Hey everyone, I'm going to show you how to use the My Save Lineups page to manage your lineups and export them to your favorite daily fantasy site. So first thing you need here is you need to save a lineup. You can use the lineup optimizer to create and save some lineups. I'm using a custom player pool of 39 watch players which are being used in this lineup that it's generating. So I'm going to go ahead and save some lineups. I'm going to do this real quick just for the sake of this video. Okay, so we have three saved lineups. Now what you want to do is you want to go to your My Saved Lineups tool. You can find that on the control panel or in the drop down menu item. So you can see the three lineups that we saved here with the total projected points of each lineup, the DFS salary, and the projected fantasy points of each player. You can see what team they're on to be sure you're not stacking too many players from the same team. If you want to optimize the lineup or change it, just click this button. It will load it back up in the optimizer. So let's say we want to play these three lineups. You're going to select the lineups that you want to play on your daily fantasy site. You have to be on the site you want to play on. So if you want to export these to DraftKings, make sure this icon in the top right shows that DraftKings is selected. If you want to export lineups to FanDuel, you have to make sure this FanDuel icon is selected. I'm first going to show you how to export your lineups to DraftKings. This is the more difficult of the two. For whatever reason, they didn't make it as easy as FanDuel did. So you select the lineups you want to play. I'm just going to click Select All, and then you click Export Selected. So wherever your web browser downloads the file, that's where it's going to be. I like to click the Show in Folder option, and you'll find an Excel file that's called Draft Dashboard Lineup, and it has the date. You want to take this file and copy it someplace that you're going to know where it is. If you know where your downloads directory is, you can leave it right there. I like to drag or copy this over to my desktop so it's easy to find when I'm in DraftKings or FanDuel looking for the file. Okay, so now we have the Excel file we need to upload these lineups to DraftKings. So you have to load the DraftKings website, click on the Lineups tab. Now you're going to see a button here that says Upload Lineups. Click that button. So now you're on the DraftKings Upload Lineups page and you want to click this green Upload CSV button. So now you're going to select that Draft Dashboard Lineup Excel file from wherever you saved it on your computer. So once you've selected the file, it will load the lineups you selected into DraftKings. Now these lineups aren't actually in any contest yet. So to do that, you have to go to the lobby, find the contest that you want to enter. You have to make sure that this contest is the same slate as the lineups that you created. That's very important. It's not going to work if these lineups aren't using the same slate. So once you're in the contest that you want to enter, you'll see the lineups that you uploaded show right here. There's four of them because I already had one lineup created, so it can get a little confusing. You have to select the lineups that you just uploaded. So I'm going to select the last three lineups on this screen. Those are the ones we just uploaded and entered them into the contest you want to play. And it's done. You've just exported and imported DraftKings lineups and entered them into the contest you want to play. So that's how to do it on DraftKings. Now let me show you how to export and import lineups into FanDuel. So make sure you're selected on the FanDuel icon in the top right of Draft Dashboard. And then you have to build a lineup for FanDuel. Use the DFS lineup optimizer. I've already got a watch players list here. So I'm just going to randomize some lineups and save them so I can show you how to export them to FanDuel. Okay, I've saved three lineups that I want to play. Now I have to go to my saved lineups and you'll see those three lineups here. You select the ones that you want to play. In this case, I want to play them all. So I click select all and now you want to click the export selected button. You'll see the file download here in your browser downloads. You can click show in folder so you can see where it is and note the number. If you export multiple files, they'll be saved with the same date with an incremental number so you know which one is which. So this is file number six for today. I'm going to copy this file to my desktop so we know where it is when we go into FanDuel. So now you load the FanDuel website and you find the contest that you want to enter. The contest has to be the same slate from the lineups that you just made. So I'm going to enter this 25 cent multi-entry contest and you need to click this enter new lineup button just like you would enter any normal lineup. Now you're going to scroll down and you're going to see a link that says upload lineups from CSV. It's going to be right next to the enter contest button. Click on this link and you'll be able to upload lineups into this contest. Choose the file that you just saved to your computer. Find the date and the number of the file you just created. Load that up and then you click upload. You're going to see it detected three lineups. It tells you what the entry fees are required to enter. And all you have to do is click enter three lineups and you're done. You just entered and imported your lineups into the FanDuel contest you wanted to play. 
So good luck everyone. Now you know how to export and import lineups into your favorite daily fantasy site. Just remember guys, never play more than you can afford to lose. Keep it fun. If you want to enter multiple lineups, try the quarter entry contest. You can play a handful of lineups without a big investment. Remember, Daily Fantasy Sports is a marathon, not a sprint. Play smart, keep that bankroll tight. And if you do hit that big win, please don't put it all in over the next couple of days. Just remember, Daily Fantasy is hard to win. Cherish those victories, save that money, and stay in the game for the long term. Thanks for watching and good luck.